For a lot of college students, it's sometimes difficult picking a major. For those who love being in the great outdoors, a career with the Tennessee Wildlife Resources Agency could be an option. Nathan Karch is North Central Television's outdoors host. He's a TWRA officer. He says there are some important things anyone needs to do in order to begin a career with the Tennessee Wildlife Resources Agency. The first thing that I would advise someone to do is basically get in touch with your local wildlife or county wildlife officer. Uh, get to know them. Um, that, that's what I did. That was basically my, my best way in. And if, if you don't get an opportunity to work with TWRA right off the bat, um, get, get your name out there and try to apply for a job that's in a relative field, whether it be some type of outdoor related field. I know for me, I worked for state forestry and that kind of got my foot in the door for the state. It, it, it was kind of, you know, paralleled uh, wildlife a little bit uh, because, you know, we're just constantly outdoors dealing with a lot of trees and, and everything like that. If you have an opportunity, I know this is not feasible for everyone, but if you have an opportunity to uh, get a some type of internship that, you know, a lot of internships nowadays are not paid, they'll give you a stipend if you're financially able to do that. Uh, you know, you could always go that route, and, and that, that experience will really, really help you because you know, every, just like everything nowadays, they're asking for experience, mm -hmm. but you can't hardly get experience because you need the money. So any type of volunteer work, and when I say do volunteer work, don't just go do the work. Really, really be involved. Um, get your name out there. Uh, be networking and, and socializing with all of those people that are there that you know hold this position that way when it comes to the application process they can actually put a face with a name mm -hmm. and that will go a, a long way they're like hey I've already met this individual I know their personality I know their work ethic uh, they're a great person and we really need to look into this so a college degree is a requirement so I know for me I went to Tennessee Tech and my degree is in wildlife fishery sciences but we've got two different concentrations at Tennessee Tech which would be the wildlife or the fisheries. So I was wildlife and that kind of sets you up for the law enforcement side of TWRA. Uh, the fisheries concentration obviously will go more into fisheries management. Um, as of right now I know that there are four universities in the state of Tennessee that offer that degree. Uh, Lincoln Memorial University, Tennessee Tech, UT Knoxville, and then UT Martin and we get graduates from from all over uh, of those four universities uh, but that is a requirement it's got to be in some sort of wildlife management uh, field and then you know general biology is fine as long as you've got uh, a few of those classes that are pertaining directly to wildlife we accept those fortunately at this time uh, we do not accept criminal justice uh, bachelor degrees uh, not sure why that is, but we don't at this time. I, I know there's a, a lot of people out there with that degree really, really wanting to, to get into this job, and, and they would they would be perfect for it, but uh, we <laughs> we stand by that, that one degree requirement right now. Karch says a typical day for him really isn't so typical. He's basically on call all the time. In law enforcement, you're, you're on the clock, you know, 24-7, uh, really. Um, I, I try to get days off here and there uh, sporadically, but we are supposed to be most active when the public is most active. So your weekends, um, your holidays and stuff like that, you, you're going to be working. Um, that's not to say that I can't go home to my family, you know, middle of the day, but, you know, probably the morning uh, when the hunting activity is big and then late afternoon again, uh, that's, that's when I'm going to have to be out. So it, uh, it's very bittersweet, you know. I, I get to basically enjoy the outdoors if you're a, a hunter or fisherman. I get to enjoy it when nobody else is out there, so that's it's awesome for me. Um, but you know, I also don't get to be out there on the weekends enjoying the, the water or you know hunting with everybody else. I don't consider it work. There are a few tasks that we have to do every now and then that you, you might not like, but that that's every job. But for the most part, I, I literally look forward to it. I, whenever I have downtime, I want to go work. I, I get so bored at the house. I, I'm like, what's something fun that I could do? And you know, a normal person would be like, well, let's let's go hunt fish. Uh, 
you know, go uh, throw some football or, you know, play some basketball or something like that. I'm like, I, I just want to go out and work. That's it. So it's very, very rewarding. Uh, you get to meet so many awesome people, um, just networking with the public, get to really know all the people in your county. Um, it, it's so rewarding. Karch says there will always be a need for TWRA officers and agents. He hopes young people will continue to have an interest in a career working outside for a living and helping their fellow Tennesseans. Reporting from Trousdale County, Barry Hyatt, NCTV.